Hi, good to everybody. This is uh, Doc Bernie, and uh, I've been thinking lately. Uh, the hope of the Philippine Chess. Our national hero Jose Rizal told us that ang kabataan ay pag-asa ng bayan. So in English, the youth is the hope of the nation. So it means that the more grandmaster we have, it means that the more chance that we will have a more world champions in the future. No, I mean Serisal, not that one. So here are the list of the top 10 uh, youngest grandmaster of all time. Uh, let's see the list. Okay, let's start the ball rolling. Drum roll. Number 10, the youngest grandmaster of all time is Bu Zhengyi. Bu Zhengyi. Uh, he's a Chinese player. Uh, in uh, 1999, he became the 10th grandmaster from China at the age of 13 years, 10 months, and 13 days. And uh, at that time, uh, what? Let's continue. Number nine, drum roll. From India, Sadwani Raunak. Uh, he has a standard rating of 2,507 and a rapid rating of 2,358 and a bit rating of 2,490. Okay, so that's all the info that I have got. So next, number eight is Wei Yi, another singkit from China. Uh, Wei became a grandmaster at the age of 13 years old, eight months and 23 days. The fifth youngest in history. He's the youngest player ever to reach the rating of 2,700 and he had only accomplished it in the age of uh, 15 years his peak rating is 2753 uh, last august 2007 and uh, his feeder rating is 2721 last october 2019 chinese are really very good i hope filipinos will have also mini grandmaster like the okay number seven number seven is of course reigning world champion magnus carlsen magnus is a norwegian chess grandmaster and the champion current world chess champion he is also a two-time world rapid Chess champion and four-time world beast champion. Wow. Uh, some considered Mother's Carlsen to be the best chess player of all time, but it's uh, debatable. Uh, such as uh, great players like Kasparov and Fischer would also be considered to be one of the best chess player of all time. I hope Merong there's a Magnus Carlsen just uh, hidden or just to be discovered in the Philippines or yet to be born so that uh, we will have a world champion from the Philippines. Moving on uh, to number six. Number six is again from India. Parima John Neji. He achieved the Grandmaster title at the age of 13 years, 4 months, and 20 days, which make him the 6th youngest Grandmaster in history. And his uh, pay rating is 2,639 as of this October 2019. Oh man, so many strong Indian Grandmaster. The support of India to chess is... Uh, very good that's why they have produced strong chess players a okay. 
moving to number five. Number five is uh, Nodirbek Adushata Tarov. Wow, from Uzbekistan. Uh, he is a chess prodigy. He qualified for the title of Grandmaster at the age of 13 years, one month, and 11 days. He was awarded the title last, last year, April 2018. His uh, peak rating is 2,608 and uh, September, last September 2019. So in the Philippines, if uh, this uh, Grandmaster would participate in the 13 years old under, for sure, he will always be the champion. Because here in the Philippines, there's always a bracket on the AIDS, bracket on the rating there's always a bracket a caption to for players weaker players to have their chance to win okay so let's move on okay number four my, my friends ladies and gentlemen again from india wow Ramanesh Babu Pragnananda. Wow. Another Indian Grandmaster, also a prodigy, is the fourth youngest person to achieve the Grandmaster title. He has a peak rating of 2,569 last August. And uh, born, uh, he has an age, he's already 14 now. Wow. So another Indian. Let's move on to number three. Number three. Jawbuker Syndrome. Jawbuker Syndrome is uh, another Uzbekistan chess prodigy. He earned the title of Grandmaster last October 2018 at the age of 12 years, 10 months, and 5 days. Wow. He's so young to achieve that kind of title it means the system of training and the support of uh, Uzbekistan is really very good and the talent of this uh, little boy is also uh, let's say exceptional okay moving to number two is Domarahu uh, Gokesh Another Indian, oh, yes. He is the second youngest person in history to qualify for the title Grandmaster. His peak rating is 2,543 as of June 2019. So many Indians, young Indian Grandmaster, are in the top 10 youngest Grandmaster in history. So from there, we can conclude that at the young age they were supported by India to have the support the advanced training that uh, an athlete should have to to get the Grandmaster title at the young age uh, in the Philippines we say we only say sana all sana all means that uh, hopefully in the philippines uh, this kind of uh, program will also be done so that the chess enthusiasts uh, would let's say be inspired and the rich uh, chess supporters would also support in the Philippines. And now let's come to the number one. It's, uh, still number one. Below it is Sergei Karjakin. Karjakin? Karhakin? Uh, whatever you call it. From Russia. He has already challenged Magnus Carlsen in the last. Uh, uh, before Fabiano Parwana in the World Championship title. Also a very strong uh, grandmaster from Russia. So he has also
Sergey is, uh, is been the second of uh, Roslan Ponomario in the Fede World Championship before when uh, Roslan uh, fought uh, Alexander Kalifman for the Fede World title. In such a young age, uh, Sergey Karyakin has been a second. Such a difficult thing to do for a young grandmaster. But for Sergey, who has been blessed with those kind of talents, uh, it shows that chess is for everyone, for the old and the youngs, as long as the brain is uh, very good in chess, it doesn't matter. Oh, don't worry, Philippines. We also have the uh, youngest grandmaster of all time, number 17, of course, the Super Hydra Grandmaster Wesley So from the Philippines. From the Philippines. Oh. He's now the Fisher Random, first Fisher Random World Champion. Anyway, it's okay if he is uh, in another country. He's still a Filipino. He was born Filipino. And uh, we should be proud. Even though he is in another federation, another country, he, he will and he will still be just like uh, Eugene Torre and uh, GM Eugene Torre and uh, Grandmaster Antonio, one of the Hall of Fame or the pillars, something to look up to, to imitate for the future generations of uh, chess players. Uh, Mabuhay uh, Wesley So. The rank is based from uh, chess.com last uh, October 2019. Top 37 uh, young chess grandmasters of all time. So, wow. 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 There are many Indians in the list. Number 15. Number nine, number six, number four, and number two. So we will not be surprised if another Indian grandmaster like the former world champion Vishinawata Anand would win the world title in the future. Just like in Rapple Draw, the more entry the more chances of winning uh, we hope that the Philippines would have also have even just a little entry to the top grandmasters of the world so that we have also a chance to win a title for the Philippines uh, thank you and uh, good chess everybody See you next time.